We are all here today to witness the marriage of Caden and Riley. Stop and enjoy the good times and commit them to memory. They'll change your life and take you to levels that you never thought possible. This relationship was built from love, patience, truth, designed by prayer and founded by God. And finding that perfect someone, well, that's almost miraculous. But you two found each other. Caden, since you were born, we've prayed for your growth, your happiness, and that someday you would find a soulmate that would help you on your path to heaven. Riley, from the day you started coming around, we prayed exactly the same thing for you, and I know your parents did as well. I have to admit, I knew quite early on you two would be together, <laughs> so I may have prayed a little harder for that soulmate part, that you two would complete each other. Although I am over the moon that this day is here, I'm not at all shocked that it came. From early on in their relationship, Bradley would say, he's the one, I just know it. Not many 18-year-olds could pull this off, but Riley and Caden, it just makes sense. They're perfect together, and I mean it. I'm so happy for you guys. Ever since you guys started dating, you have been a great example to me of what a relationship is supposed to look like. There's nobody that is better suited for Caden than you are. I cannot wait to see what this new chapter brings for you guys and everyone around you. <laughs> I've done it! Couldn't be more happy for you and more excited to see what great things that you guys have in store for you. We love you guys. <laughs> Our Holy Father, we are so thankful that we've been blessed to be a part of the lives of these two, to see as they have uh, experienced the joy of this life and following you. We pray that as they begin this life and acknowledging you in this prayer, that they will always seek you first in all things, realizing that as they do that, they'll fulfill their vows to each other, to have the strength, the hope, the guidance for each other in times of trial and times of joy. We thank you for that love. Thank you for the love they share. In the name of your Son and our Savior, we offer this prayer. Amen. I, Caden, take you, Riley, to be my wife. I vow to respect, cherish, and love you each day, to keep you warm when it is cold and dry when it is raining. I, Riley, take you, Caden, to be my husband. I vow to respect, to protect you, to forgive you, to listen what you have to say, and tell you what I need to say, to be your companion in the face of loneliness, to be your comfort in the face of fear, to support you in victory and console you in defeat, to labor with you on our journey to heaven, to choose you every day of my life, to love you forever and ever and always. Riley, do you take Caden to be your husband to uphold the vows that you have recited for your family and friends? I do. Caden, do you take Riley to be your wife to uphold the vows you've recited before your family and friends? I do. By the power vested in me by the state of Missouri as your parents, and most of all, by the Lord God Almighty, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Caden, you may now kiss your wife. It is with extreme pleasure, enormous pride, and massive excitement that I present to you, Mr. and Mrs. Williams. Yeah.